Hello everyone and welcome back to Steam Free Game Highlights. Today we're playing Finger Bang, all bullets playing. Now hopefully it's a good game, because the last couple games that we've had were not. There's also no music here, which is weird. Hopefully, you know, there's actual audio in this game. Gang activity has surged ever since a new dangerous drug called Strutasol appeared on the streets. It came from nowhere and made life hell for everyone involved with it. Unlike other mind-altering party drugs, Strutasol heightens the senses of its users to almost unnatural levels for as long as the drug stays in effect. 11.36 p.m. While the Strutasol currently available on the streets is used through an inhaler, there are rumors of it being distributed in a more potent raw form within the inner circles of criminal organizations all over the country. Now, one of the, these local gangs, the Blood Drop Boys, are planning on distributing this stronger drug to just about anyone who has the money. The longer the police chief cowers in fear of these gangs without taking any action, the more criminals and vigilantes will take to the streets. Things will only get worse if we don't act now that we have the upper hand. Intruder found. I was able to knock him out. How would I know? Some pig out of uniform. Knocked a box over him. Bastard almost shot me. Yeah. Missed my face by an inch or two. Nah, I'm fine. Lost a small portion of the product during the struggle, though. It was on the box I kicked over. Bag wasn't sealed properly or something. Hey, it's not my fault. I didn't package the damn thing. Yeah, whole thing spilled over. Poof, like a pink cloud. Dude inhaled quite a bit of it, too. Yeah, I got a face full of powdered sugar. Enough to kill a rhino, if you ask me. Yeah, yeah, I'll check. Holy shit, he's still breathing. Someone get me my gun. What? No, he's still alive. Why? You sure? I don't know. Sounds too risky. You got any authority on that? We're already behind on schedule, and failure is not an option. He what? Uh, oh, okay. Alright, boys, let's pack up. The trucks are waiting outside. We are leaving him like he is. Don't ask me. Order came from the top. Yes, really. Now pack up your shit and go. 7.58 a.m. They left me alive? Nine thirteen a.m. You disobeyed my orders again and single-handedly ruined all of our preparation to shut down their entire operation. Now Paxton is aware of our plans and has put the entire gang on high alert, all thanks to you and your stupidity. Then why did you- Quiet! You're done! Hand over your gun and your badge and get the fuck out of my office. 108 p.m. There's some weird storytelling we got going on here. 11.48 p.m. Oh my god. That's not what I was expecting to see. Oh, God. Anna? 12, 12 a.m. The first thing was that smile. She was still wearing that innocent smile on her beautiful, blood-stained face. She was dead before she even hit the floor. 12.24 a.m. To think that such a childish gesture would be the cause of so much destruction and death. My hand breaks everything that I point to. Well, everything besides myself. I don't feel like myself anymore. Very well then. I'll use this chance to do what I could not before. Paxton thinks he can unleash this thing to the public and destroy lives without consequence. I will prove him wrong. This time I won't need a badge or a gun, or permission from those who believe themselves to be my superiors. They made me into a monster, took everything from me, and now they will suffer. 1.20 something am. The infamous Red District. Over the 
the past few years, association with Pakistan's blood drop boys and volatile gang activity in the surrounding areas has made it a nearly lawless hellhole. No one dares to visit this part of the city without good reason these days, and those who do rarely make it out in one piece. Some sound effects would be kind of nice here, not gonna lie. Oh god. I take back what I said. Jeez. That was so loud. Yeah, hopefully this is good. Uh, sensitivity is good. Love the sound effects. Oh god, it's super, like, super tight and sensitive on the movement and stuff. You let go of forward and you lose all momentum. You also move super fast. Okay, interesting. Press left shift to dash, dash during a jump to cover greater distances. Okay. I didn't realize dash meant teleport forward. You can dash up to twice in a row. Jeez. Oh, that's what those blue things are on my reticle. Left mouse button to fire. Press E to interact with doors. Death awaits. Press F to melee. You can also right click, I guess. Melee red enemy projectiles to parry. Blue projectiles cannot be parried. That's pretty funny. Interesting. Does it matter which path I go down? Dual wield power up doubles fire rate but disables melee. I see. Got him. Berserk power upgrades damage reduction and heals on hit but disable shooting. Okay, so basically that power up sucks. First Q to activate bullet time, bullet time recharges faster with kills. Move so fast, it's hard to aim. Boss unlocked? Where? What? Why? How? Oh. I... No, this would be how I got up here if I went down the red path. Hmm, walls may hide secrets within? Ooh. Secret as in, is that a QR code? Hold on. Oh, what the heck? It's just a portfolio of the dude that made the game. That's weird. Boss fight looks like you in the arena until the boss is defeated. Locks you in the arena. Okay, well he's not shooting me, so... That was easy. I oh, we're timed? I got a disgusting... Secrets found one out of two. There was a second secret. Oh. That's not cool. That's not cool. I gotta lower the music on its own, too. It's just a little too loud. Wake up. Uh, there's two different paths. I'm gonna go this way. So many people. It's giving me flashbacks to that A Wall game I played, which I was going to do a part two of, but I never <laughs> got a chance to because it was just too <laughs> difficult. Girls, girls, girls. Oh god. <laughs> oh good. <laughs> Good 
God. Maybe my sensitivity should be turned down. Since you move so fast, maybe I need a little bit more precise control over aiming. It is nice that there's no ammo in it. My issue is now it's hard to just turn. Might be good to aim specifically at people, but turning... I don't think that actually made it any easier. Whatever. We'll just get used to it, or we'll die trying. Oh, that is a gentleman's club. Wasn't I just in there? Yeah, what kind of gentleman's club is this? Ain't ant onion? Interesting. Do I get a flashlight? I can't really see over there. Okay, it's gotta be something down here. This is where I started. Nothing? Where am I going here? to kill everyone in the city? I'm assuming it's that gig. I need to remember that I can dash. I'm not entirely sure what the purpose of that is going to be, but I can do it. Two people dead. Two more people dead. So basically we're just trying to stop these drug lords from drug lording around. Seems simple enough. Unlocked. Okay. Okay, it seems like the best strategy is to just find somewhere to funnel them all into one opening. Yeah, there's nothing up here. Just had to. Jeez, this is so many of you out of nowhere. Now, a flashlight wouldn't actually be all that bad of a mechanic to incorporate. Not gonna lie. Flashlight would be pretty sick. see any secret walls anywhere. Not like I would even know where one would be hidden in a place like this. Well, this isn't creepy at all. Pax 
just in himself? What the heck? I see. The thing that makes it hard is I gotta actually aim where I'm hitting it back. Which makes it almost impossible to do it while I'm also trying to dodge blue dots. Or it doesn't even matter because I can just shoot these bits. That thing that makes things much easier. I just need to actually uh, dodge the bits. Shouldn't be too hard after the amount of Terraria mods I have beaten. Or I can get absolutely annihilated. But how am I supposed to survive that? It's all blue ones. I can't reflect them. I can't dash enough. It's impossible. I actually just don't understand what they want me to do. Nothing you can do there. It's so sudden. Am I like breaking the wrong one? Or there's a secret thing that opens up right here. Okay. That was really dumb. You get very little time to find it. Bruh, Paxton, you're a bitch! My man, my G, you smell like beef. Can I not grab that? I guess I'm not healing. Thanks. Cool. I feel good about that. Come on, man. This boss fight is stupid. It is really dumb. Can I just damage them all really low during this initial slope phase? Okay, it takes 11 shots to break a piece. Okay, so if I just hit all of them 10 times before I break one... too far away, I don't have enough time to get over there, so I just get my butthole touched. I might have to end it here. I'm not sure I can get past this. Yeah, 
no, there's no way I'm getting past that. I gotta end this episode here. Finger bang, all bullets pointing. The concept is really cool. The gameplay is pretty good. It it could use a little bit more refinement. The story is kind of it, it'd do better with sound effects or at least music to go in the background doing it. Maybe some voice acting. And the boss fight right there is complete and utter garbage and should be completely reworked. With that being said, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.